Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, yellow shaded uh, semicircle with the center O oh, fully inscribed uh, in a blue triangle uh, ABC, as you can see in this given diagram, such that uh, these points uh, P and Q are the points of uh, tangency. And moreover, this side length of this uh, triangle uh, is uh, 13 units. This uh, other side length uh, BC is uh, 14 units and finally this uh, side length uh, AB of this blue triangle is uh, 15 units and now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, yellow shaded uh, semicircle please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% uh, true to the scale let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step since we are interested in calculating the area of this uh, yellow shaded semicircle. So therefore, uh, we are going to calculate the radius uh, of this uh, semicircle first. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, blue triangle uh, ABC. And now we are going to calculate the area of this triangle uh, ABC. And we are going to use the Heron's formula to calculate the area of the triangle. And here's the area formula, the square root of uh, s times uh, s minus a s minus b times s minus c where uh, s is equal to a plus b plus c all over 2 so no wonder this uh, lowercase s is called the semi perimeter and now i'm going to label uh, this side length uh, as lowercase uh, a this side length uh, lowercase b and finally this side length uh, lowercase uh, c so therefore our lowercase a value is going to be 13, lowercase b value is going to be 14 and lowercase uh, c value is going to be 15. And now we are going to fill in the blanks in this formula to calculate uh, this lowercase s value. So therefore uh, s is going to be equal to 13 plus 14 plus 15 all over 2. In other words, uh, our s value turns out to be 21 and here's our next step now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, abc we have already calculated our s value as 21 so therefore uh, i can substitute this uh, s value as uh, 21 uh, over here and here uh, this uh, s minus a is going to be 21 minus uh, 13 this s minus b is going to be 21 minus uh, 14 and likewise uh, this s minus c is going to be 21 uh, minus uh, 15 as well as you can see in this uh, next step i have substituted those values and now let's make an observation we can see 21 minus 13 is going to give us uh, 8 21 minus 14 is going to give us 7 and likewise uh, 21 minus 15 is going to give us 6 and now let's focus on this uh, 6. 6 could be broken down to 3 times uh, 2. As you can see in this uh, next step, I have replaced this uh, 6 by 2 factors 3 times 2. And now we can see 7 times 3 is going to give us uh, 21. And 8 times 2 is going to give us uh, 16. And now we can see the square root of 21 times 21 is going to be simply 21. And the square root of 16 is going to be 4. That is going to be equal to 84 square units. So thus the area of this triangle uh, ABC turns out to be 84. And here's our next step. We are going to connect this center O with these points uh, P and uh, Q. As you can see in this uh, next step. And now we can see this uh, OP is the radius uh, of this uh, yellow semicircle so i'm going to label this one as lowercase r likewise this uh, oq is the radius as well so i'm going to label this one as uh, lowercase r as well and now let's recall the circle uh, theorem according to this theorem the angle between the radius uh, and the tangent will always be 90 degrees so no wonder uh, this angle and this angle are going to be 90 degrees each since uh, these are our radii and these are our tangent lines and in this uh, next step i am going to connect this center o with this uh, vertex c as you can see in this uh, next step 
And now let's make an observation. We can see the area of this uh, bigger triangle uh, ABC is going to be equal to the sum of these uh, two individual triangles uh, AOC and the area of the other triangle uh, BOC as well. So this whole uh, blue triangle uh, ABC area is going to be equal to the sum of uh, these uh, two triangle areas. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this triangle uh, AOC and the other triangle uh, BOC as well. And now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, AOC. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times base uh, times height. So therefore for this uh, triangle AOC, the base uh, of this triangle is uh, 13 and the height uh, is radius uh, lowercase r. So therefore the area of this uh, triangle uh, AOC is going to be a half uh, times uh, our base is uh, 13 times our height is uh, radius r. And if we simplify that is going to give us uh, 13 r divided by 2. And now we are going to calculate the other triangle uh, BOC area as well this uh, triangle area and we are going to use the very same area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times base uh, times height and for this triangle the base is uh, 14 units and the height uh, is uh, lowercase r so therefore I can write a uh, half uh, times uh, 14 uh, times lowercase uh, r let's simplify that could be written as uh, 14 r divided by 2 and now let's recall this equation once again. The area of triangle ABC is going to be equal to the sum of these uh, two triangle area, area of triangle AOC and the area of triangle BOC as well. And here's the area of triangle uh, AOC. Here is the area of triangle BOC. And this is triangle uh, ABC area. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, equation. So we got 84 equal to 13 r divided by 2 plus 14 r divided by 2 as well and if we combine these two fractions that is going to give us 27 r divided by 2 as you can see in this next step and now I'm going to multiply both sides by 2 divided by 27 on this side and 2 divided by 27 on this side to isolate uh, radius r and here we can see 27 27 cancels out 2 and 2 is gone so therefore our radius uh, r if we simplify this uh, left hand side that is going to give us uh, 56 uh, divided by 9 so thus the radius of this uh, yellow semicircle turns out to be 56 divided by 9 and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, yellow shaded semicircle and now let's recall the area of a circle formula area equals to pi r square where r is the radius and since uh, we are dealing with this uh, semicircle so therefore uh, this uh, semicircle uh, area formula is going to be pi r square divided by 2 so therefore uh, the area of this uh, yellow semicircle is going to be pi divided by 2 times uh, our radius uh, is uh, 56 uh, divided by 9 uh, whole uh, square. Let's simplify. That is going to give us uh, pi divided by 2 times uh, 56 uh, square is uh, 3136 uh, divided by 9 square is uh, 81. And if we simplify the right hand side, that is going to give us uh, 1568 uh, pi divided by 81 uh, square units. So thus the area of this uh, yellow semicircle turns out to be 1568 pi divided by 81 uh, square units. And that is going to be approximately equal to 60.82 square units as well. Thanks for watching it. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.